This is the weekend, March 5th, 2006. Welcome to World News 1. In Europe, there are signs of the H5N1 bird flu virus spreading. A French mayor bans chicken from school canteens. Germans are abandoning cats by the hundreds. Greeks and Italians virtually acting poultry from their diets are all signs that a worried Europe is inching toward what some have called a bird flu psychosis. In Austria, a provincial hospital in Bergenland has even reserved 20% of its beds for possible bird flu patients, even though no human infections have been reported anywhere in Europe. An edgy public is taking its own, not always rational, precautions against the deadly virus. Really, that's pretty obvious. And yet the World Health Organization say H5N1 will become a human pandemic killing millions. Tokyo, Japan. Scientists in Energy Poor Japan say they have found a new source of gasoline. Cattle dung. The new technology will be a boon for livestock breeders to reduce the burden of disposing of large amounts of waste. Oh, no kidding. And you thought it was bad with all that biodiesel french fries. Woo! Buffalo, New York, USA, a part-time prosecutor was fired Thursday after he attended a conference sponsored by a white supremacist group. He said U.S. policies on immigration, trade, and demographics have put the USA on the wrong path. He also referred to the European Christian Americans as an endangered species. Switchland! Here in Boulder, Philip Martinez was found guilty of second-degree assault, but not ethnic intimidation, for beating up Andrew Sterling, a mixed-race CU student. He called him a nigger, and he will face a sentence between 5 and 16 years at his April 21st hearing. So we have laws against using the N-word, but in this case it doesn't count? Ugh. Rosh Pina Israel, U.S. pop diva Madonna wants to buy a house in the Israeli town of Rosh Pina, where the ancient Jewish Kabbalah tradition expects the Messiah to appear at the end of the world. Two years ago, Madonna took the Hebrew name Esther and reportedly observed the Jewish Sabbath. Like a virgin, woo! Touched for the very first time. She's just a regular Mary Magdalene, that one. I'm Jen with World News One. We bring you Boulder. We bring you the world.